What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel and this Thursday we're taking a look at what's coming as we usually do but it's going to be a bit of a different Thursday update because we know that season 5 is 100% confirmed to kick off with Dominate the Game. That is the name of the season 5 update and that is going to of course tie in with the brand new update to the overall game which is going to be v3.4 so this says that they're going to be releasing it on the 21st of march which is tomorrow thursday the 21st of march and it says that as a token of our gratitude we're going to be giving users a chance deal uh, for the next couple of days when they install v3.4 it's going to be in your inbox so this thursday is going to be a bit different i think we're going to get cards i think we could get a couple of different bits and pieces coming but i do feel that listen lads this is a big update man i think that this needs to bang this update needs to bang there's so many things in the game that need to be fixed and need to change a lot of the response issues a lot of the ai assistance needs to go also with this as well we're going to be getting new objectives now there is a bit of a rumor floating around that we are of course going to be getting that new ai event that is up on the official website as well with the konami official website here as you see will that tie into the season 5 objectives is that why there's only 12 or 13 hours left on this season five kickoff here because it means that it's going to be recycled back into the brand new mode let's see man let's see the, the wording on this mode could be could be could be changed a bit we also of course are going to be getting our teaser as we always do from konami on the official twitter account of the new player of the weeks so we're going to be getting a double pack usually when there is a european competition or when there's a national competition such as the euros or the world cup or whatever or the champions league or the europa league we usually get european club player of the weeks and the regular domestic league uh, player of the weeks as well so you can see here as well that we have got this tease sent out by the official konami eFootball twitter account and it looks like it's going to be arsenal's goalkeeper uh rea and, and julian alvarez from city as the whole player that they're talking about there and then musiala who was absolutely fantastic for Bayern the last day um domestically and Lewandowski, who's been banging him in looks like he could be getting the boost as well based on the teases that we've got there and the players that align with their nationalities with the tees so also on top of that it looks like this is obviously um a fan driven uh, concept art of who else could come so mbappe and Vinny jr are probably going to come as well there are a couple of players in here not all of these are going to come obviously you know you've still got your dabarea in there you've got alvarez in there as well um just a different design here but as i said these are fan concepts uh, of what players could come but rafinha i don't think he'll come uh guerrero they usually don't bring two players from the same squad so i mean there's two players in there uh from city and there's two players in there from atletico so let's see who comes but i do think mbappe will come Vinny jr and kane probably will come again and then also for the other player of the weeks we'll have a look here again in a second as to who else could come but this isn't a bad option and this isn't a bad um a bad kind of one to have here as well mbappe could come in this pack instead of the euro um and then obviously you've got musiala in there as well so it just depends man I think a lot of the time with these players, sometimes, you know, I do videos where I kind of predict and said, yeah, he scored two goals, he scored a hat-trick, he had three assists, he had two assists and, you know, scored a penalty or whatever, and they don't bring the players. So I do feel like they kind of get these players in early doors and unless there's, you know, a last minute change, they leave it at that. So this is another prediction here, as you see, as we zoom in on this, this is going to be another prediction there of who could come. Again, this is just a couple of players that people think uh, might come. This is from our buddy eFootball tribe on twitter as well and, and there's a couple of nice players in there i mean let's see if rafinha comes man i don't know he hasn't had a card in a while and then for harry kane alvarez alvarez looks like he's definitely going to be coming with the tees and then also we will probably get mbappe whether he'll come with this one or whether he'll get a double release which some people are predicting as well i mean mbappe could just have a card every week honestly i mean he's so good but to be honest with you lads all eyes i mean are going to be on you know we'll have big times as well but all eyes are going to be on the gameplay honestly i just feel at this stage man that the gameplay needs a massive 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 boost of things you know we talked about it you know we've done a stream we're going to be streaming at length tomorrow we're going to be starting early we're going to be doing a quick roundup in the morning and then we're going to be banging on with a big all day stream with lots of stuff to talk about lots of stuff to test and look we will we will be testing the game online man we'll be testing the game online in divisions and actually playing the game and really kind of getting underneath the surface of what 3.4 is going to be about because some of the clips you're seeing here 
yeah, I mean, it's just time for a change, man, with some of the AI assistants and some of the stuff that happens. Now, you can still have some beautiful passages of play in eFootball, and that's what keeps me coming back. But I want more of the good stuff and less of the frustrating stuff, as is the case with every video game that you sit down to play. But that is it for me, lads. Don't forget to subscribe. Just a quick little video to keep you guys up to date. Are you hyped? Are you putting a lot of impetus on this new update? You know, is it important that this update bangs? Are you kind of fairly happy with the game? Let me know your general read in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in the live chat tomorrow.